Hi, Product Manager from Salesforce Automation Team here. Let's take a look at how sales teams can use sales cloud forecasting to track real-time changes, customize their view, and improve forecast accuracy with deal insights. When I come to my forecasting tab, I quickly get an idea of my and my team's forecasts in real time, monthly or quarterly, and with the associated opportunities. I can expand any of the months to see how each of my reps are doing. Within the grid, I can see any recent weekly changes, and the quota attainment bars tell me how each of the amounts compares to the quota. I can also use the Einstein prediction column to add a layer of judgment on where my reports are likely to land at the end of each period. And to make the view my own, I can choose what I see in the grid. And I can view custom columns such as commit coverage or pipeline coverage as we can see here. Now with just one click, I can drill into each of the cells to see the opportunities that roll up to the total. Here, I can easily see which deals have been updated, such as this deal stage being advanced. And I can also access each deal's insights and recent activity by simply opening the side panel. Sales managers can use this information to apply their own deal-level judgments to mark whether they think a deal is likely to land within this period or if it is likely to slip. Now back in the grid, managers can see what the deals that have already closed and those that they marked as in are adding up to. And this informs a much more accurate commit adjustment that they now feel confident in and can add any adjustment notes needed.